The Collector, a brand new character that has just been revealed in the latest combat cast, and I gotta say, he looks and sounds very different for a Mortal Kombat fighter. Tarkata must pay tribute. We pay with blood, not gold. Shao Kahn demands both. As the name suggests, the Collector's main role is to collect the tribute in the name of Shao Kahn from all the different races that reside in Outworld. So whenever somebody refuses to do so, they have to pay with their blood instead of gold. When it comes to his combat style, he's more of a close range fighter as shown in his fast combos in which he uses 4 of his 6 arms to give his opponents no chance to breathe. But being a combo master doesn't mean that he has nothing to show from a distance. The collector can whip out a multitude of different items from his backpack which he can throw at his opponents causing some serious damage. Another character that was revealed is Aaron Black, who returns with his revolvers and rifle along with some brand new moves that we're gonna look at here. The first is a jar that contains reptiles acid, which serves mainly to create enough distance to start shooting the opponent from afar. But if that doesn't work for you, there is the Nether Beast Trap which works pretty similar to the Acid Jar but with the option of throwing it towards your opponent in case you want to jump in for close range combos. Dynamites have also been added to Eren's arsenal and are used mostly to finish off opponents in his command grabs. Moving on to Noob Saibot, he seems to have retained most of his moves from MK9 as I said last week, including the iconic Shadow Slide, the Shadow Charge and the good old Teleport Slam. Now Noob's default look is actually brand new in this game and he resembles some kind of a Death Lord. However, if you'd like to go classic with this character and choose his ninja look, you can do that as well. There have also been new moves that were added to him in this game such as the Sickle Teleport which to me is the fanciest way to teleport we've seen so far in this game. He also has a new projectile called the Ghost Ball which is unblockable and causes a great deal of damage if lands. With this I end today's video, let me guys know what you think of these characters particularly the Collector. For more make sure to like the video and subscribe to Gamelution.